Hi everyone, welcome to another video. So another day and another stable Android 10 update for OnePlus 6 and 60. In this video, I am going to tell you how you can get the same on your device and what fixes does it bring for you all. You know what to do right? So before we start, press the bell icon and subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss out on the new awesome videos. So to check whether you have got the update or not, you just have to go to settings. Here go to system, click on system updates. If you have got the update, you will get a screen like this. Also please note that this will not format or erase your device in any way if you are moving from the stable update. After that click on download and install now button and wait as the system will download the update and install it automatically. After this process gets complete, restart your device and wait for a few minutes. Please be patient as this will take some time to complete. The second method is you can download the zip file from link in description below or use oxygen OS update our application from google play store to get the update as soon as possible and here are the change logs for it you just have to download it wait for some time after that go to settings click on system go to system updates click on this gear icon on the top right corner after that click on local upgrade and choose the file that you have downloaded also please keep in mind to move the downloaded file from downloads folder to the internal storage so let's talk about the changes this update brings to the table. So the notch settings are back now. You can go to settings, click on display, click on notch display and here they are. Though they are a bit messed up right now but that is what it is. It's a good thing they heard us right? Another important thing they have fixed with this update is the latest Android security patch of November 2019. Which I think was the biggest thing they missed out on the last stable update. But now it's here. They've also fixed the issue with navigation bar. It had some issues with the keyboard so now they are fixed and also some issues with digital well-being and fingerprint scanner. So a quite big list of changes. But the stable the better right? I hope this works even better for most of you guys as some of you were facing issues. So don't be disheartened, it's rolling out now. I will advise you to wait for the stable OTA update if you can. Or else use this Oxygen OS updater application. So that's it for this video guys. Do let me know if the problems you had with the previous version of Oxygen OS are fixed in this update. And if you have any questions, do ask them in the comments down below. I'll try to answer them all. Subscribe to the channel and like this video. Stay tuned to the channel for more. Bye bye guys. I'll see you in the next one.